da, 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 da. I was so excited. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for coming back to join me. Uh, today I have an unboxing video for you guys, and I'm so excited to open this up with you guys. Um, this is my actual first Louis Vuitton that I bought myself. Um, I was gifted Louis Vuittons in the past, but those were gifted from my grandmother. So this is actually my gift to myself. I actually bought it for my birthday. Um, my birthday is July 29th, and I'll be turning the big four zero. So I figured why not you know it's kind of long overdue if you get what i'm saying so yeah i went ahead and gifted myself my girlfriend recently went to milan so i took advantage of that opportunity um because while she was there i asked her to stop and get me the bag um the reason why i don't know if you guys know but in europe luxury items are actually cheaper there um, this bag was about $200 cheaper there than it is here. And I'll go over that later, but yeah, that's pretty much what happened. And I was like, hey girl, I'm about to be 40. Can you give me a bag? Thanks. <laughs> so yeah, let's get started. I'm so excited to open it. I haven't seen the bag yet. Um, well, she sent me pictures of it, of course, but I haven't seen it in person. So yeah, I just like, let me just eat and unbox with you guys. If you guys are interested and want to see what I got, then keep on watching. Okay, guys, so this is how it comes packaged. Um, so it's just the Louis Vuitton box, as you can see. And so we're going to open this up real quick. I'm so excited. Ooh, okay, so it comes in this dust bag, Louis Vuitton. Um, and. Oh, it's kind of folded up in here. Is that normal? Okay. <laughs> so, this is what I got, guys. I got the Speedy 30. It smells kind of funny. I guess it's the leather. Um, but yeah, I'm going to order from Etsy the shaper so that it can be shaped and then keep its shape. And they also have like the little compartment organizers that you can order as well for the bag. So yeah, this is the bag, this is the inside. I don't know if you guys can see, basically just brown. Um, and then it has the zipper in the inside, I can pull that out. So there's the zipper. And then, where's the serial? Okay, and then the serial number is here. Hopefully you guys can see. Um, and then let's see oh okay and then they put this in there and I'm assuming this is the keys that go to the bag Ugh. yes these are the keys that go to the bag so really cute even though I probably won't ever use them so yeah I chose this bag uh, I was actually debating between the Speedy 30 and the Neverfull but I do like the number four. However, I felt like I wasn't going to be able to dress it up. I mean, yeah. I just didn't feel like I could dress it up. And with this bag, I could dress it up or dress it down. So, and I just feel like, like a satchel is more me than a tote bag, if that makes sense. So, yeah. This is what I went with. And just to give you guys an idea of what I paid for the bag um, compared to U.S. prices. So the bag here is $1,020 and in Milan it was 800 euros. Um, so and that equals to $906 in US dollars and then you get 12.5% back at the airport. Um, and you just have to fill out some paperwork. I believe it's the taxes that you get refunded back. Um, so yeah, 12.5% that's $113.25. So I saved about 200 and around $220. That was a really good deal, you know. Got to save a little bit of coin. So yeah, um, I'm very excited for my bag. Happy birthday to me. Yay. So yeah, I'm getting ready to fill this bag up because I will be rocking it every single day. This is definitely going to become my everyday bag. Um, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye.